See, it was really good. He got to come to Texas. I think it's probably his first time in Texas too. So um, me, him, and Rashad got to work with his receiver coach on working, running routes, you know, technique and stuff like that. We got some really good work in. With the Browns, with El Sondra? Um, No, no, no. We we brought in this other dude because El Sondra's probably here. We're working on the draft stuff. So who were you? What receiver's coach are you talking about? What was his name? <laughs> I'm not going to go into those details. It was a receiver coach. All right. All right. All right. Well, well Cody also point. said that he, he took it upon himself to work on vertical, throwing the ball downfield more. And part of that is making decisions quicker, but also physically doing it. Because how would you think he did? I mean, could you notice a difference? Right. You know, he was working extremely hard. I think we got a lot of great work and like extra work, too, you know. Um, and it was great for him to come down there. You know, he could be on vacation and stuff like that. And we call him right up. He's, I'm on the way. So um, that just shows how much he really cares, too. How do you feel about no Terrell Pryor on this team this year? Um, you know, it broke, broke my heart. Me and Terrell, um, really, really good friends. You know, um, a relationship is unique. I, I have to say that. And, um, you know, he made the best decision um, for Terrell. And um, can't get mad at him for that because he made a decision on what's good for him. And that's how I look at it. Do you feel this makes it important for you to step up your game now? You're kind of like the guy, aren't you? <laughs> I feel like if he was here, I feel like it was important to step up my game no matter um, who's here. Um, that's just how I'm built and how my mindset is. He was, had some he was, real good moments uh, in your first couple of games. And then your stats weren't there when after you came back. What are the different things that happened that uh, caused that to be the case? Um, you know, it's tough as a rookie coming in. Got to learn a lot of stuff, and um, you know, then I get hurt. I miss a lot of time. I miss six games. Um, not getting the practice reps. Um, you know, it's just a little bit different. And then I come back. I'm not even playing with the same quarterback. <clears throat> I played with the first two games. I feel like. And it's just like a lot of stuff buys into it, but now I know what to expect. And um, I'm looking forward for a great season this year. How interested are you to see that, you know, the draft is going to be uh, a week from Thursday? How interested are, are you uh, to see what the Browns are going to do and who's going to be on the team in a week or so? Um, I just like all that type of stuff. And I was there a year ago, so it's like crazy to what these guys who's about to get drafted, like, you know, how, like, my eyes were so open, like, man, I just got drafted to the NFL. So I'm excited for those guys, and I'm excited to see um, who we pick because I know the guys upstairs um, make great decisions and um, best best decisions for our football team, too. Do you know Miles Garrett? And uh, if, if either way, what, what do you think of him as a player? Um, his stats and his um, stuff what he did at the combine speaks for itself. Um, but, you know, what I've heard about him, or he's a great player and a great person. So. You ever met him? No, I haven't met him. Corey, the first time a year ago, at this time, a week before the draft, did you know you were going to end up with Cleveland? Absolutely not. When I was going through the draft process, I remember sitting up in Coach Hugh's office, and Coach Hugh was like, um, it'd be impossible, impossible for us to get you. I was like, huh? He's like, yeah, we got the number one pick. So they started moving back and stuff. And then he asked me, he said, where do you think you're going to draft? I remember this. I said, I think I go top 20s. I think you go top 10, somewhere in that range. I'm like, oh, okay. And um, it's crazy. So I got drafted to Cleveland. Then I came back. I asked Coach. I said, when I sat in your office, did you knew that y'all was gonna draft me? He said, yeah, I did. <laughs> <laughs> what was that about a week before? Um, no, it was like, man, like probably a month before. It's crazy. Hey, Corey, when those rookies walk in next month, what's the first piece of advice you're gonna give them? Um, listen to the coaches and, you know, just try to learn as much as you can because, you know, I feel like, well, with me, like, I just have to learn so much so fast and um, it, it kind of, for a receiver, it kind of slow you down on, you don't get to play it as fast as you want because you're thinking, then, like, you kind of nervous, you don't want to mess up instead of just going out there and playing football. Were you surprised how much you had to learn after what you did in college. Right, right, because in college, you know, I went to Baylor. We didn't have a playbook. So <laughs> my first time seeing a playbook was when I got here. A big old packet. I'm like, what's this? I'm like, well, you got to learn all this. Okay. 
<laughs> and it was a journey, but now I understand. I understand how the NFL works and how you know things work. So, like I said, we got a better understanding. So that should make the second season a lot smoother or easier, I suppose, since you, are, since you don't have to be overwhelmed like that. Right, 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 exactly. What do you think of Kenny Britt? Um, from hanging out with him and stuff, you know, he's ex excited and always, you know, happy guy. And that's what you want on your team. You want a guy, you don't want, no, like they say, no energy vampires, um, negativity. We want, we want guys in the locker room who's exciting and who hap or are happy to be here. And, you know, he's one of those guys. He's excited to play and happy to be here. So I really like that about him. When we've talked to, to Hugh and to Sashi about your rookie season, you know, both have said that, you know, we and, and fans were too tough on you. Um, how do you view your your first year in the NFL and, and how it went? Um, you remember I, I, a while ago I said it was a lot of disappointing, but it's just like I, I learned a lot. You know, I missed six games, and, and that was the toughest beat. I don't think a lot of people understand that I missed six games as a rookie, and I guess they expect for me to come back and just be Superman. And I'm still learning stuff as it goes on. But um, I just take it as motivation, you know. Uh, it's okay if y'all hard on me. I'm hard on myself, so I feel like this is motivation for me to do even better. You said a couple weeks ago that with TP leaving, you're, you're viewed as the guy now. And uh, he really looks to you to be that lead receiver. How are you taking that challenge from your head coach? How do you look at that? I feel, I feel like I've been the guy, so I, I don't know. <laughs> That's how I feel. But I just take it as a challenge, you know, another step. Like, it motivates me to want to do good and not let this organization down. And, um, and that's what's driving me. How are, you, how are you better, I mean, from this off season? Have you, I mean, have you focused on certain part of your game, route running or anything else? Definitely route running. Um, I feel more comfortable. I'm not going into a situation blind, not knowing what to expect. You know, now I know what to expect. I, I know how practices are run. I, I know how they do stuff in a weight room. I know everyone. I'm more comfortable. Were you able to relax a little bit this off season, Corey? Because you know, rookies, you know, you're preparing for the combine, then you're getting ready for the draft and all that stuff. You really don't get much time to relax here. I, I, I did relax a little bit when I first um, got off, but then I start, you know, working on what I need to work on to make me a better football player.